this is usually how we train our robots, is actually someone teleoperates the robot, so they have to physically move the robot. And right now, what he's doing is he's training the robot how to do a task. So traditionally, people will train a single model per robot. In Gemini Robotics 1.5, we're actually using a single model across multiple robots. So here's an example. We're hanging things from that workbench. One of the key things in 1.5 is that now all of our other robots can actually do the same task. This actually works on a completely different robot, which is the Aloha robot. That was very nice. This is a good way to understand the learning across embodiments. Aloha has actually played quite a bit with the wardrobe scene. Apollo here has never seen this scene, and we're gonna ask it to do something completely new, which is to open this door right here, which is something it's never done before. A little bit more. Can you ask it to pick up the clothes in it? So this is a great example of a completely new motion that is able to learn with the Aloha robots and not just transfer here. Yeah. In the future, where you might have some robots in a particular application, like in logistics, or another robot in a particular application, like in retail, and they're all actually learning from each other, really accelerating the pace at which we can learn to make truly general-purpose robots.